It is legal to openly carry a weapon in Washington state, as long as you don't use it to scare or intimidate. But is that possible if it never leaves the holster? K2's Adam Gassimi shows us charges against a Vancouver man are creating quite a buzz across the country. Kirk Kirby still won't talk to us. It's not that we don't want to. Just like earlier this month, after getting a ticket for openly carrying a handgun outside this Vancouver shopping center, the city attorney's office is now pursuing charges in a case that's getting national attention from gun rights groups like OpenCarry.org. This is the first case where we have seen a person charged under this statute for doing nothing more than carrying a properly holstered handgun as they go about their daily lives. The law says open carrying is illegal in Washington if it manifests an intent to intimidate another or that warrants alarm for the safety of other persons. City Prosecutor Kevin McClure says don't be so quick to believe Kirby did nothing wrong. Wait till you have all the facts to make a, a judgment about what happened here. Some of those facts may be witness accounts of Kirby, quote, eyeballing customers or keeping his hand on his weapon while in its holster, or as one witness put it, like Wyatt Earp, ready to draw. Reports also indicate Kirby and his wife had to be escorted out of a Vancouver mall the day before when employees and managers complained about weapons strapped to their waists. The basis of the charge is not the fact that this there was a weapon being carried, uh, the the issue is the manner in which it was displayed that warranted an alarm for the safety of others. Kirby's attorney tells me he's disappointed by the charges, all in a case where his client should go to trial in May. In Vancouver, Adam Gassimi, K2 News.